inconvenience that some parents face. They have to miss work or pull their kids out of school to appear in court. First at four, one judge is working to fix the problem. Brittany Weir with the 19 Solutions team walking us through how he plans on doing that. When I got this appointment, I thought, well, what can I do to help? Judge Michael DeLeon was appointed to Lake County Juvenile Court in July. Previously, he worked at the prosecutor's office for 22 years. One of the biggest complaints he heard during juvenile traffic cases came from the parents, not the teen drivers. And believe it or not, it wasn't about their child getting a ticket. They had to take off work during the day, and a lot of parents would say to me, well, I'm losing $100 or $200 because I have to be here, and then I'm also going to have to pay a fine for my child or court costs for my child. That's like a four dollars or $500 swing. So Judge DeLeon came up with a solution, night court. Wednesday was the first night. For two hours, the judge heard cases and ran the courtroom just like normal. I thought if we could do this at night and schedule it out, and so far the first night was a, a success. All the parents were so happy. The judge says this is a pilot program for now and it will take place on the first and third Wednesday of every month. We looked at schedules and when we could get security here, when we could get our staff here and other programming that the court might have. Judge DeLeon says this program wouldn't be possible without his staff. Most are working overtime or volunteering to make this work. I want to do this minimal with a minimal impact to, because I'm cognizant of doing something at night and spending taxpayers' dollars. That's very important that I spend them wisely. He says they are going to keep night court as a pilot program through the end of the year with hopes of making it a full-time program next year. In Painesville, Brittany Weir, 19 News.